I'm on my own. I'm doing it for the girls. Are you solo female traveller? I'm a solo female traveller. I was so nervous to come. You're actually the perfect candidate for this video. Oh, really? Because I get... Good morning, everybody. Good morning. It is day two Fitness Street Soy Thai Phuket Thailand Day in the Life series. It is the 15th and uh, we're just kicking off our day, quarter to nine in the morning. Uh, we're gonna show you the highlights of our day, what we're gonna be doing in terms of training and eating and all that kind of stuff. So if you're looking at coming out here uh, and you'll find this video to be valuable in your preparation for your adventures here in Phuket, Thailand. We just had our coffees at Cocoville a uh, really cool place here and uh, this one actually has a class at Unit 27 called Calorie Killer. So all those calories we ate last night are going to be killed off in this morning's Unit 27 class. Uh, afterwards in the afternoon I'll be doing a private class at CMT Muay Thai which is here on Fitness Street as well, a little side street. Uh, so you get to see the highlights of me getting a private Muay Thai class at what was known as Chok Chai. Now CMT. So, and then in between that, we'll give you some highlights of where we go to eat, give you some price breakdowns and all that kind of stuff. And just general day in the life stuff here on the streets. So, now that I got that out of the way, how do you feel, Robs? I'm, I'm trying to get my head around what is coming. Apparently this class at Unit 27 is pretty intense. And after the little um, ratter chai session last night. <laughs> that was pretty hard. Previous video. I mean, it's only our what, second day, so um, we are sort of really getting into it. Um, I'm just a bit, you know, I'm getting my head around it, guys. Getting my head around the yeah. next uh, hour of my life. Yeah, so. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we're, it's, it's actually a nice day so far. It's beautiful. This, it was pouring with it rain was, last night, guys. Oh, I'll clip in last night's <gasps> rain real quick. We couldn't leave the restaurant. Yeah. <laughs> I had to crazy. put my, my camera in a, in a plastic bag, <laughs> but we're at the tail end of the wet season here. So, uh, all right, we're going to get changed and this one's going to get ready. Yeah. We'll see you at Unit 27. See you there. All right, so uh, Calorie Killer is about to start in 30 minutes from now. Uh, this is Unit 27. Just a quick look on what it looks like before we get into the class. There's Miss Swale having her Red Bull, the M150. I need it, guys. I know it's really early in the morning. Yeah, it is. You do need it. But it's this is the second day. Day two. Why did I sign up for this class on the second day? Well, because it says calorie killer on the website, and that sounds like a good what idea. What are you trying to say, Bradzi? <laughs> that you don't need to kill any more calories than what you've already killed. Now we're about to start the Unit 27 class. Actually, you're about to see the guys come in here in about five seconds from now. There's 13 stations set up here. We have bikes, we have sled runs, we have everything here. Medicine balls, the whole lot. I'll show you real quick. That's what it looks like. And in literally 10 seconds from now or so, the guys are running back. They're all gonna jump on their stations in teams of three, I think. You'll get to see it in just a second. And uh, it's gonna absolutely rock. Unfortunately, I'm not doing the class, but maybe I will and Rob's can film me. But right now they're doing their warm-ups over there on the hill. Anyway, five seconds from now, it's gonna be intense calorie killer. Here we come. How do you feel so far? Man, I'm so broken. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. You're looking great by the way. You're killing those calories. Right? 
way that I'm sick, I've got issues. Stick with the bars, I've been privileged. Bent off a of sips of elixir. Make bro need the commas and digits. My man heard I'm honest and kidding. Lay down my tips for attention. But been had it popping, I mentioned. This business life, I'm offended. It's cool, yeah, I get it though. That's about how they feel. That's uh, come together, that's it. Well done. You killed it. You killed those calories. Good on you, Robs. How do you feel? Man, that was amazing. Intense workout. I've done it in a while. It was really intense. She nailed it, didn't she? Man, you? such cool girls that I, they were, that I was doing it with. Teamwork. Team for two girls. Had girls. And we were all like encouraging each other, and it was so much fun. Like when you're in groups like that, you're not isolated. I really enjoyed it. Um, obviously, it's my second day I got jet lag, and I'm not as fit as I used to be. But it makes me want to do more to get fit. You look very fit to me. Oh man. <laughs> this is an intense class, guys. Maybe don't do it so early on. Maybe ease yourself. Ease yourself into it. Super fit, of course. Guys, Avanash, India, right here. Just finished Calorie Killer, oh. Unit 27. Yeah. How do you feel, mate? I'm feeling amazing. My fourth time here. Today is my first class. And I thought I was the pro at this shit, but I'm fucking natural. <laughs> <laughs> mate, you look good, man. I'm sweating. I'm doing nothing except pushing <laughs> buttons. That's actually more of a workout, believe me. Any, <laughs> it is a bit of a workout. Any tips? Uh, First timers, any tips? Just come here, go at your own pace, and enjoy the experience, man. This, this place and the street is a different, like life changing. Absolutely How friendly? Changing, How man. friendly is this place? Uh, uh, everyone over here is on the same wavelength. So you come here and you sit and you can talk to absolutely anyone. I made some great friends here last time and we still keep in touch on WhatsApp and Your friends for life. Instagram, yeah, for sure. Your friends for life. Yeah, fitness for life, friends for life, yeah. Tony from Perth, Australia. Yes. How do you feel, mate? Good. Same class today. Yeah. It's the place to be. For everyone? Yes. Where are you from? England, Bristol. Bristol? Bristol. Should all the Brits come out here and train? 100%. I'm on my own. I'm doing it for the girls. Are oh, you solo female traveller? I'm a solo female traveller. I was so nervous to come. You're actually the perfect candidate for this video. Oh, really? Because I get a number of messages from solo female travellers and Rob and my girlfriend as well yeah. about whether it's safe to come here. A hun I have not felt vulnerable once. I'm staying at Cocoville. I got all my advice from your videos and I, yeah, I actually did um, and blog posts and I swear to you it's not scary, It's you feel safe, everyone's doing the same thing and I actually think 90% are on their own and a lot are females so don't be scared, please. Great. That's a good message, I like that. See? Come, no more DMs from your solo female travellers. You've got to come out you've here. Kelsey said so, it's yeah, okay. Yeah, you've got to come. How long are you for? Uh, I've been here a week, I've got one, I leave on Saturday. So I've got four oh, my days, I know, I'm so sad. I don't want to go. I'm definitely coming back. And I might when? even bring my mum. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, 100%. man. She must be checking in because yeah. she must be worried about her daughter. Like, she is, she is. Yeah. She was very a bit skeptical and a bit like, oh, I don't know where we should go. But now I've shown her around. I took loads of videos, shown her everything, and she's like, I'm all hooked. For it. I'm she's, coming. She's, she wants to come. Mum's is coming. Yeah, mum's is coming. I love her. <laughs> all right. Thanks so much. Yeah, thank you. I'm going right. to die now. Electrolytes, rest. Uh, then more time. Great. So that oh hold, actually before we go, yeah. Top tips. Three top tips for people, specifically solo female travellers. Yeah. What should they do? Electrolytes. You need your water. Electrolytes. Get those in. Make sure you eat your food because I struggled at the start to get it in between sessions, but you seriously, seriously need your food and rest and enjoy yourself. I know that was four, but enjoy yourself. That's number one. Part. Yeah, that is number Electrolyte one. Electrolytes should be out. Great, <laughs> yeah. great tips. Thank you. All right, guys, get your asses here. Ooh, Kelsey come, says so. <laughs> Alright guys, we're on Fitness Street here, Phuket, Thailand. We're at a protein shake bar on the street. Bamboo protein shake bar. We just finished our protein shakes for 100 baht, four or five Australian dollars each. I have Mason in the house. What's going on guys? Expect where, a miracle. How you where are you from, my man? Virginia. Virginia. First time here? Yes. Yes. How long have you been here for? Going on 16 days. How do you feel, mate? Uh, a lot of pain, but uh, I've gotten rid of uh, a lot of arrogance, and I think that's that's definitely worth it. Look at this guy. Are you going to come back? Absolutely. Yeah. Yes. And so, when do you fly out? When do you leave? I'll have to I'll have to remember my t look at my ticket, but I'm pretty sure it's the 28 or the 29th. It's the morning of one of those days. So I know I've got a little less than two weeks left. Good job, man. And we have Christian. 
What's up, guys? And you're from? Colorado. Colorado. Yeah. Welcome. And your first time here? Yep. Yeah, definitely going to come back. And how long have you been here for so far? I've been here for about four days, and I'm going to be here for a month. A month. And where have you tried? Where are you? So where are you training at the moment? Tiger Muay Thai. TMT. Yep. And TMT. All right, and we have the whale. Foxy. The whale. We've all seen this face before. <laughs> Just finished a unit 27 class here on Fitness oh, Street. You probably don't recognize me after that class. And that was hectic. Yeah, so we're just chilling out here. It's super hot outside, and um, yeah, it's just amazing. You should definitely come and check this place out, as I always rant about this place in previous videos. Guys, top tips for first timers. Top tips. What do you recommend, Mason? Do not take as many supplements as you're used to at home. The only supplements you need is salt at every meal, <coughs> trust me, uh, water and D-Light, and then add in supplements slowly as you get acclimated to the weather. Because no amount of heat, no amount of humidity is gonna prepare you for the hard work you're gonna do here just in your first week. Um, top tips. Top tips. First thing that comes to mind is probably bring band-aids or athletic tape because as much as you train, yeah, that's a good tip. You man. get so many blisters on your feet yeah. that you gotta wrap them. That's... I mean, so antibacterial <laughs> ointment, or yeah. whatever, and some athletic tape. Yeah, just like a little first aid kit or something. Yeah, yeah. So it's good to meet these guys. They saw the videos in the previous series, and uh, they're gonna. Can I, can I shout out to my gym? Go, man. Uh, Go Martial Arts in uh, Stafford, Virginia. Uh, Professor Kelly Grissom, thank you. And uh, Coach Miguel, Coach Carlos, expect a miracle. Love you guys. Get your asses out here. Have they been out here before? Uh, Coach Miguel has. Coach Miguel has. He knows what it's like then. So anyway, I'm gonna wrap it up here. We're gonna spend about 10 minutes here, then we're gonna shoot off. All right? Peace, guys. Here, just met up with a couple of dudes, a couple of guys. Mason and Christian, we're just at the front of uh, Unit 27, just a quick one. There's Unit 27 just there, it's a class that Robin just did. There's a protein shake hut there, so you can get all your protein shakes on the street for about a hundred bahts, about four or five Australian dollars for a protein shake. And uh, in fact, there's two of them, so there's one there. Unit 27, protein shake bar. There's Robin. And another protein shake bar just there, so you'll see all those protein tubs there. All the bananas hanging down and all the fruit and things like that so little bamboo um, bamboo huts where you get all your protein shakes and nice meals as well very cheap very fresh uh, don't need to worry about food poisoning i've never been food poisoned along here so uh, anyway we're gonna rob's gonna have a shower i'm gonna tape up my calf because i pulled my calf uh, just by bouncing around with the camera all right so we're in the uh family mart here on fitness street cannot stress enough Water, hydration, you're gonna need it. So we're buying a six pack. And this will probably last us uh, a day or two days? Three days? Two or three days. Two or three days. Every training session we seem to have one full bottle with a rehydrator in it. Yeah, so you're taking... So this is 12 classes right here. Uh, maybe six classes. It's probably a couple of days. It's probably about no, three no, days worth. get two of these. Oh yeah, I see. Yeah. It's one o'clock. Anyway, you'll definitely need... And this is great. It's a great deal. That's the price there. You can come back convert that to your own currency, but yeah, we're stocking up on water. So I am uh, getting treated for a calf injury. Uh, day two, one o'clock in the afternoon, pulled my calf bouncing around with the camera in the Unit 27 class, filming this one behind me. I wasn't even doing the class <laughs> and I pulled, but it's a pre-existing injury. I pulled my calf a few months ago, it hasn't fully healed, so um, okay. Rob's is putting some rock tape on it now. So day two here on Fitness Street out of a one month trip and uh, already dealing with uh, injuries, so. Okay, so we're about to get something to eat and uh, we're going into Trooper Eats, which I think it's run by or owned by Unit 27 because it's got their name all over it. It was called the Muscle Bar when I first arrived here a couple of years ago. But I haven't been in there since they've called it Trooper Eats, but uh, it's on Fitness Street. It's like a two second walk from Unit 27. Uh, and it just seems like an appropriate thing to do for Rob's, given that she just did a training session at Unit to go and eat at Trooper Eats. 
at uh, 1.30 in the afternoon, I think, day two. We're at uh, Trooper Eats here on Fitness Street. We'll show you the menu and what Rob's has. It looks amazing. Check this out. Rob's. I'm so hungry right now. What is that? This is a, an, obviously an omelette, but it's got spinach and it's got sweet potato in it, bacon. And, and mashed potato, um, and avocado. And guacamole, so it looks like a, a guacamole mix. So that is on the menu, El Cordo, isn't it? El Cordo omelette for 290. And mine's coming. 331 so, calories. Guys. Yeah, so here on the menu, they've got all the calories listed next to everything on the menus here. Mine has just arrived. I'm not envious of your food anymore. Oh, okay. Because my protein pancakes have arrived. This is a triple stack of protein pancakes right here. Look at that. Banana on top, cinnamon. And about 15 grams of protein, I think. Protein smoothie bowls, shakes, protein shakes. Protein shakes cost uh, 90 baht with water. Right there. This is about three or four, about four Australian dollars for a big protein shake here. Honey Nut Bliss, Very Licious, Phuket Paradise, Coconut Island, Mango Magic, and it goes on and on. And you can add Creatine, L-carnitine, BCAAs, you can add all of these. Come and check this place out. It is Trooper Eats, right there. There's the sign. Okay, so it's two o'clock in the afternoon, Tuesday, day two. Rob's about to get a massage here on Fitness Street. Oh yeah, really good air conditioning in there and you need it in this place, it's so hot. But Rob's is going for a one hour massage, which is on Fitness Street, as I mentioned. Uh, and uh, actually, Blue Hotel is just there. To give an idea, opposite. opposite, straight opposite. That's what it looks like. There's a big red sign, you can't miss it. And then there's a fight zone shop next door. So yeah, that's best how you find it. And the best on the street, ever. in my opinion. Yeah, me too. In my humble in opinion. <laughs> in my, in our humble yeah. opinion. Yeah. So and when I'm gonna. Walking, it's like the happiest faces. <laughs> yeah, they're so super happy. friendly. These ladies are super friendly. Yeah. Anyway, so I'm leaving Rob's here because I'm not having a massage right now. I'm going to take you on a little excursion on Fitness Street. I want to show everyone some few other places on this street. So stick around. If you're coming with me. I'm leaving her behind. And then we're doing, I'm doing a group class this afternoon at CMT Muay Thai. So Bus I'll bring you. And she's going to film me and my broken calf. So yeah. anyway, have fun, Rob. Good luck. No pain, no gain. It's five past three in the afternoon, day two. And I'll uh, just give you a little bit of perspective here. So if you decide to come here, you know what to expect. We have Ali's barbecue just there. So if you ever come here, you definitely must check that place out. The food there is incredible. The menu is amazing. But last year when I was here, these places weren't here. So I'm gonna show you what's changed in at least the last 12 months. Firstly, and then I gotta go. I'm gonna be talking for two or three minutes and then I gotta run, pick up Robin, and I got my class at four o'clock. So we have Evolve Health Club. This, this wasn't here before. So they, do, they have a gym, BJJ floor, Muay Thai, they do classes here, group classes and drop-ins, like one-off drop-in classes. This is what it looks like from the street. So there's a private session happening at the moment, Muay Thai training session at the moment and uh, I'll walk you through real quick. But this is the floor area for Muay Thai. They do group Muay Thai classes here. Uh, I, I don't have time to show you this whole place, unfortunately, because I've got to run. But if you just go to Google and just type this, I'm sure this place has a website. I'd be very surprised if they don't. So Evolve Health Club, check out their prices, check out their schedule but they basically have BJJ, have yoga, Muay Thai, and the Muay Thai is here. They do functional training in this area as well. That trainer was the guy that I trained with last year in a private session. And they've got a little restaurant here with keto food on the menu. Um, we'll walk down there later on and the gym and everything's inside. I gotta go, but before I go, <laughs> there's so much here, I don't have time, but anyway. So there's a little supplement store which has just opened up here. It's called Gorilla Supplements. And uh, I'll show you what it looks like right here. Gorilla Supplements, right there. 
Just your ordinary supplement store. So they got whey protein, BCA, BCAAs, creatine, shaker cups, uh, whey protein, all of that, uh, all inside. And um, it's right next to Evolve right there. And Top Team is just over there. So Top Team have been here forever. Little sign there, Thrive Restaurant. That food menu does look amazing and I will take you in there at some point. Hello. And anyway, I gotta go, I don't have time, so. I've, I've done nothing, I've just packed my bag and I'm sweaty. <laughs> That's how hot it is here. He's just... literally drenched, like I touch him and he's wet. Yeah, I've done nothing, that's the thing. I've looked like I've worked out. <laughs> anyway, so she's just finished a massage. One hour massage at that awesome massage place. How much was it? I can't it's remember how much. Uh, 450. 450 baht, yeah. yeah. For and one hour, I mean, good. you get the most incredible treatment from mm. these women. They, they really Who did you get... have? Oh, Alicia? Oh, or... I can't remember her name now. Sorry, guys. I will make a point of make, I'm making a note of that next time I go in. She's such a, she's a very, very young girl, but she has healing hands like I've never known. She's amazing. Magical hands. Yeah. You look really relaxed. Man, they take care of you in there. You really gotta go. If you come you here, do guys, have to go there, yeah. Please, like I've tried a lot of Thai massage. I'm a Thai massage therapist myself. Of course. I've trained in it. She does everything. And I mean, you, I've gone to them and they're just really, really good. They really do it by good. the book. Uh, it's a quick one. I am about to start a group class drop in at CMT Muay Thai here in uh, Fitness Street, Phuket, Thailand. Uh, last time I was here, it was called Chok Chai, now it's called CMT. Same location, just different name. That's what it looks like on the outside. Big shed, uh, green floor mats, lots of bags. And over there, they've got the main office. And there, they've got their own little accommodation there. So you can stay there if you wish. Um, if you just want to do all of your training with these guys. Don't know how much the rates are, but I'm sure it's on their website. So I'm not going to bore you with those details. I'll let you just Google it. Um, CMT Muay Thai Phuket, Thailand. There's another Muay Thai school here called TNY and I trained there last year, did a private session in there and then we have Titan Fitness just over here with their outdoor boot camp style training. We'll be there in the third week so we'll give you some video content, stick around from Titan Fitness but um, just doing the Muay Thai thing for fitness, uh, it's great for fitness, you should definitely try it if you haven't already. Solo female traveler, uh, starting a fitness journey, pro fighter, like when you want to start Muay Thai something different, um, this is a great place to do it. Come here, try different classes, taste everything. There is plenty of Muay Thai gyms here. Uh, there's plenty of variety. As I said, TNY is just behind me and uh, CMT is in front of me and uh, Titan Fitness, which is more for general fitness, boot camp style training, emphasizing the major lifts, overhead press, deadlifting, squat, and all of that. I gotta get ready for my group class, so Rob's is gonna film the highlights for me. I have a busted calf, so I'm gonna do my best. Yeah.